This is John Young from the Hometown News and Hometown News TV. Today we're going to do a short little tutorial video on how to transfer a video or a photo that you have taken on your cell phone or mobile device, how to transfer that over to us so we can use it on the Thursday show, our Thursday live local news program that launches launched last week and is available every week about 7 o'clock. We're hoping that we'll have it on schedule. We were a little late this past week. But this tutorial will walk you through on how to send your photo or short video. Now if you're going to shoot a video, the idea is you want to shoot the video and you want to have it ideal ideally to hold your phone this way as opposed to this way. Now this isn't a deal breaker. We can certainly make it work if we go sideways or go up and down, but this gives us a much wider. Now of course if it's a, a vertical thing that's going on, a silo, if you want to take a picture of a silo, this would obviously be better. But try to take them in a horizontal method and try to keep it somewhere between 30 seconds and maybe two minutes. Those should be able to be uploaded to our website with the method I'm going to show you. Photos, either way doesn't really matter too terribly much. Obviously the the horizontal way would be better, but vertical will be fine as long as you're able to get close enough to whatever you're taking a picture of. You can send that to us and this is how you're going to do it. So let's pop over to the phone and take a look. So we're looking at my cell phone right now, and the way you do it is you go down to the bottom. In this case, uh, I've got Safari. You may have Chrome on your phone, but we're going to hit the Safari down there and open that up. There it is. And I've already logged in, but I'm going to I'm going to take us back to that. And the the quick way we've got you can go to the hometown news dot biz website, or the quicker way h t n e w s t v dot com. So it's htnewstv.com. So it's the hometown news, but this is a direct link to that area. And it might be just quicker to type that in when you're in a hurry. htnewstv.com. And then you'll hit go, and it'll pop you over to this page. You can see the progress bar there, it's loading. So there's three ways to be able to do the get a photo to us right now. You can send it, you can click on that little blue telephone number, and that is our text link for texting in photos or texting in some information. That's actually a Google number, so you can text it and it will come to my phone eventually, but it's the Google thing, so that way we can kind of um, monitor that a little bit better and Google's got some spam filters that are built in. Uh, below that you see the john at hometownnewstv.com. That's the email address you can use if you want to send some information to us. A lot of the a lot of the of upcoming event information and things you send to the hometown news, Lori at the hometown news, those are also uh, she gets those over to for the um, over to us for the Thursday things and brews them over. Here's the interesting area to upload right from your device. You continue uh, down a little bit. There we are. We have got an area there. So what you will do is you will click on that select file. You can't click the upload because you, you haven't selected anything yet. So we're going to click on that select file. And I'm going to, I can either take something and do it live, or I could do something from my photo library. I'm going to go to my photo library because I want to find a video. Um, there's a video, there's my videos. And, oh, I've got this really nice looking video from Long Prairie the other day at the beach. This is a beautiful day. So I just highlight it, and then I can click done. And you'll notice that it moved the name in there. Now that is not to us yet. That is just kind of in a staging area. Now... You can put in a description. Um, let's go put Long, Long Prairie. Date recorded Friday would be good enough because we'll figure that out. Location, LP, and a phone number. If you wanted to add a phone number, in case there's going to be some situations where I've got questions, this would be where you'd add the phone number. So I would just put phone number. Okay, there I've entered up my information. Now you can go more in depth with um, the brief description, a couple of sentences. I just did this for the demonstration purposes. Now, when I have that in, you don't have to have any text in there, but obviously it would be nice to have so we have an idea of what the what we're looking at. And then you can click the upload right there. You see that in the upper right-hand corner? You click that upload. And now you'll see that bar, that progress bar at the bottom. If everything's working right, you should see that little bar making progress, as you can see. It's moving right along. This is actually quite a large video. It's about a 30 second shot that I, I took the other day up at Lake Charlotte up in Long Prairie. Because we have a fairly quick internet connection, and most of the time when you are on your cell phone, you will have a pretty decent internet connection, and it should move along quite well. Again, this is about a 30 second video that I shot just to get some scenery because we're gonna use that as kind of a background for part of the Thursday night show, which of course, 
We'll be back again this week, Thursday night at 7 p.m. It is just about completely uploaded. Obviously, a two-minute video would take about four times as long. Internet connection, if you have a poor connection, is going to take longer. If you have an older phone, it will take even longer. There we are. It is up. Right there, you can see the little success. It says, file that image has been uploaded successfully. And that is it. Very simple, very easy to do. You don't have to be logged in to be able to get a video over to us, and it's uh, it should work pretty much every time. You know, there might be some situations on some browsers it may not work if there's different blocking going on, but overall, everything we've tested it on, it seems to work and work very well. So, just a really quick tutorial here today. I didn't want to take too much time for the way to get photos and such over to us here at Hometown News and Hometown News TV. Thank you for watching.